but me and Cora wrote testimonies asking for a hearing, and mine was kind of focused that on that my and future generations need a future, so um, having a climate action plan would help that. Um, so I, I think I'll just go ahead and read that. Um, my name is Maddie Brooks, and I am an eighth grader at Project Libertas. This past summer, I was taught to use my voice, to stand up, to make myself be heard. But in order to be heard, you need an audience willing to listen, and that's your role today. Climate change has been demanding to be noticed lately, and a lot of people have chosen to ignore or deny that fact. Not us. We've noticed. We've noticed the temperature rising, we've noticed the ice melting, we've noticed the extreme weather conditions. Some people may have excuses or say we're imagining all of these situations, but being doubted on facts, it wears me out, let alone all of these guys. Which, may I pause, was kind of cool because I brought my class with me and they were kind of running behind when I was pulled up to speak. And as I read that line, my whole class walked in, so that was kind of cool. How, ma how many of your classmates are here that came to the hearing? That's fantastic. Schoolmates. That is about having someone. We call that having someone's back. Awesome. Yeah. Um, it wears me out, let alone all of these guys. On behalf of the youth, I ask you to take the necessary and responsible steps as our state's leaders to grant us a hearing regarding a climate action plan to ensure my future is guaranteed. Citizens of Indiana are counting on you, and each and every one of you have the chance to make a difference. So ask yourself, why not take it? My future, my, my and future generations are depending on the decision you make. Our futures, they're in your hands, and it's up to you if they're good ones or not. And that Very was my testimony. Nice. So my um, testimony was not necessarily focused more on the facts like Maddie's was. Mine was more focused on my, our futures. Hi, my name is Cora Gordon, and I am an 8th grade student at Eastwood Middle School. First off, I would just like to thank you for giving me time to share my opinion and listen to me. I'm here to express, express the fact that we, as an Indiana, need a climate action plan. Climate change is a real, real hard-hitting challenge that we must face. It is not something that, that can just solve itself. Now, I know some of you probably think that nothing major will help happen until you're dead and gone, but what about my future? I want to grow up and I want to get a job, but the way things are going now, my full-time job will be surviving. And what about generations younger than me? Will they even know what life was like when people didn't have to scramble around like animals for food? In all honestly, honesty, I am terrified. I'm terrified for my future and also for Indiana. So think to yourself, do you really want all your hard work for this country to be all for nothing? Do you want your kids, nieces, nephews? and grandchildren to have all to have to give all they have just to survive? Will you have a plan? Will you have a plan that could save hundreds and thousands of lives and futures? Because I need that plan and so do all the generations younger than mine. So speaking in front of the environmental rules board was like really tough but once we got up there I mean I know I felt like all my nerves just went away and like I was so determined to getting this but when we were shot down like I mean me and Maddie were sitting like just mumbling to ourselves like oh no this can't be happening and um I mean there were tears in our eyes because we were just so like upset that this was happening and that we were getting shot down and um after like after the meeting some of the like representatives wouldn't even like look us in the eye. It was actually a really like motivating experience because we were asking for something to make our lives better and them thinking for themselves basically told us no. So that was kind of powerful. We'll definitely see us back there. Yeah.